I'm standing in front of the Boeing 7779. This is the new uh, version of the Boeing 777-300ER. It's got a composite wing. It's got a new engine from General Electric. Uh, it should be in service in mid-2025. Uh, there's approximately 325 orders from 11 customers. Uh, and the aircraft itself is going to seat between 430 and 450 passengers. This is the airplane that's going to basically replace the A380 uh, with airlines like Emirates, Qatar, Etihad, Lufthansa, Singapore, All Nippon, and of course Cathay Pacific. There's some real blue chip customers that have signed up for this airplane, and this is going to be a revolution in travel because it's going to burn approximately 40% less fuel per passenger than an A380 does. And that's great for the environment. It's great for the airline's bottom line. This is an awesome bit of kit. We're now on board the 777X. Now, this aeroplane still has the same fuselage as a 777. But what they've been able to do, because they know the strength of the 777, they've been able to re-sculpture the supports at this level and widen the cabin by a number of inches. And what they've also been able to do because again, they know the strength of the 777, is they've been able to cut larger windows. So you get, you're going to get much bigger windows on the 7779, and it's going to be wider, so it's going to be more comfortable. Now this is a test aircraft, so it's full of all sorts of equipment, which you can see as we pan around to the side. Uh, there's some seats here, um, and a, a raft of test equipment, which we're going to show you a bit more of, in the next video. So this is the heart and soul of how they test an aeroplane. Beside me here, banks and banks of computers and stations with different uh, experts sit and they monitor every single element of these aeroplanes before they're certified to fly passengers. Uh, it's an incredible bit of kit, but essential for the certification of an aeroplane like the 777X.